The newly added fencing surrounding Oceanwide Plaza was meant to deter vandals from adding more graffiti to the towers, but it didn't stop a group of people who broke in this morning. LAPD wasn't far behind. Eyewitness News reporter Mark Cotarobles is live downtown with the news of the arrests. Mark? A young man appearing to be live streaming his interaction with police is arrested after emerging from the now infamous graffiti covered towers in downtown LA. Minutes later, a second arrest. We asked that guy what he was doing while hiding out on the property overnight. Yeah, we were literally like playing Monopoly up there, like board games, and just like doing a hangout and looking at the graffiti, but we weren't doing graffiti. Like we didn't even bring spray paint in. We were just like exploring it because it looked cool, you know? Police telling me this was the first successful breach of the property over the past two weeks after wild stunts like base jumping occurred. After holding the perimeter for hours overnight, LAPD officers this morning finally moved in in search of additional trespassing suspects. Police say those located are booked, cited, and released. They also say it's not worth it. I really think somebody is going to get seriously hurt tagging up this building or jumping off the building or a social media site. There's a lot of open wires, uh, exposed wires, exposed rebar, exposed metal sticking out of the sides of the building. It's, a, it's not a safe place to be up. I won't even send the officers up there right now to even search the building. And the bathtubs, there's bathtubs in some of the rooms, and those bathtubs are filled up with water from the rain. It's, it's pretty disgusting, and it's, pre it's really dangerous. Meantime, as LAPD continues its enforcement, the city is still in the process of installing higher fencing around the high-rise buildings, trying to keep out the taggers and trespassers. We were about to head down on our own anyways, and then we were trying to get everyone to meet back up. And now back out live, LAPD officers seem pretty frustrated about the situation when you consider all of the resources being spent on this. 18 police officers have this property surrounded 24 7. That is 10 units. These are officers that are patrol units that otherwise should be responding to 911 calls. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.